significant development in the Jubilee Hills gang rape case, the Juvenile Justice Board in Hyderabad pronounced that the four minors charged with gang rape can be tried as adults. The board said that this is because the alleged offences against them are heinous in nature and four of the five juveniles were aged between 16 to 18 years at the time of the incident. Meanwhile, the fifth accused, the son of an AIMIM MLA, will still be treated as a minor. Remember, the gang rape happened on May 28 this year and a total of six accused were booked in the case, including five juveniles and an adult named Saduddin Malik. Now, this is the latest that is coming in from Hyderabad. Uh, this is a significant development in uh, the gang rape case where the Justice uh, Juvenile Justice Board has uh, finally pronounced that the four minors who have been charged uh, for the gang rape can be tried as adults. Uh, we have seen that there was a lot of hue and cry after that gang rape case and after the arrests were made, uh, you know, uh, there were uh, five uh, persons, five juveniles who were arrested in that case, including the son of an AIMIM MLA. Uh, now, the son of the AIMIM MLA will still continue to be treated as a minor in the eyes of the law, but four other accused uh, who were between 16 to 18 years of age at the time of the incident can, will now be allowed to be tried as adults. Uh, so, this is the development that is coming in from uh, Hyderabad uh, about the Jubilee Hills gang rape case. Now, we had seen that, uh, you know, this case had taken place on 28th May this year and the police had booked six accused in this case. Now, of the six accused, uh, five were juveniles. To give us more information on this, I am being joined by Swastika Das live from Hyderabad. So, Swastika, four of these accused can now be tried as adults and not as juveniles. Important judgment there. Absolutely, and a significant one and an expected one, considering that the Hyderabad police was fighting for it with the backing from the TRS government. Remember when the entire incident happened and it sent shockwaves across the country, KT Rama Rao had also said that these uh, accused should all be tried as adults and they should not be spared. Now, in that context, the Juvenile Justice Board's recommendation and judgment is significant. So, what really happens right now is four of the five accused will be tried as adults in a POXO court. So, their legal team, um, which some of them we reached out to yesterday, have told us that they've already prepared and they are, in fact, planning the next course of action, considering that the Hyderabad police claims they have solid evidences against all the accused. What happens to the fifth accused in the case, who is an MLA son? Well, the nature of the crime that he perpetrated is different from what the others have done, meaning that he was not present in the car in which the girl was gang raped and sexually assaulted and tortured. Uh, he got off before the incident took place. And that's the reason why his quantum of uh, the sentence or his quantum of the crime is different than his other accused. But having said that, uh, there is palpable outrage also considering all the accused right now, all the six accused, including an 18-year-old Sadaduddin Malik are currently out on bail. But their legal team are certainly worried considering that the case has now been fast-tracked in a way with the Juvenile Justice Board recommending that they all must be tried as adults.